Hey, what's up guys? Mike at Red Fox here. Uh, in this video, it's gonna be a quick one. We're gonna talk about how to calculate your electric rate and how to use that information uh, for mining. So here we're looking at my electric bill. Uh, you can see this is my current bill. Uh, and from here, we're going to get two pieces of information. One is you're going to look for your kilowatt hours used. Every bill will have this. There's mine, 3,672. And then, of course, every bill is going to have what your total amount due is for that billing cycle. You can see mine here is $486.17. All you need is those two pieces of information to calculate your electric rate. So let's bring them over into my spreadsheet here. That's going to help us calculate that and do a few other things as we get into the mining part of this. So you can see I've entered my kilowatts used, my bill total, and then just dividing those two is going to give me that I pay 13 cents uh, per kilowatt hour electric rate. I see a lot of people make mistakes when they look at their bill. They're going to come over here. They're going to look at some of these numbers, think they only pay maybe 8 cents per kilowatt hour, but they don't. So that's the way to get what you actually pay. I do this personally every month just to see where my bill is and where my rate is. Um, I will pay more, for example, in the summer months than I will pay in the winter months. And I like to know when that's all happening so I can see how much I should be paying out of pocket or selling uh, from mining to cover my electric cost. Uh, the other piece of information that is helpful is your uh, amount of days in your billing cycle. So my bill provides this right here, 32 days. And I want to plug that in there and you'll see how we utilize that in a moment. And then I look at this in two ways. I look at this in terms of a rig and what that impact on electricity is going to be, and then as my total farm and what that will be. So we'll take an example rig here that uses 750 watts. If you're wondering, uh, 6 by 3060 Ti will do the just that. I've copied my electric rate over, and now we need to figure out how much this rig would cost to run per day. And so we do some math here. We're going to take the watts that I utilize per hour and make sure we're doing that per day. So we're gonna do times 24, and then we need to convert that into kilowatt hours, which is why we divide by 1,000, then ultimately take that number and times it by my electric rate to know that I will pay $2.38 a day to run this rig. Now, let's take that 32 days in this billing cycle and figure out how long, how much it would cost to run this through that whole bill or how much it did cost to run this through that whole billing cycle. Uh, and that was $76.26. So that's the number that you would maybe want to know you're paying out of pocket or you want to sell some of the stuff you mine to cover or just that's the number you know you have to hit and then everything else afterwards would be profit. All right. Let's have some fun and look at my total farm, which uses 3,125 watts and costs, same math here, almost $10 a day to run. And then let's look at how much that costs for that whole billing cycle. That costs $317.76. And if you really want to have some fun with this, let's see how much of my electric bill was used for mining. You can see if I divide... Uh, the cost for this rig to run and then my whole bill total, you'll see that 65% of my total electric bill uh, is going to mining. So that's a number. Um, but anyway, that's it. This is just really quick. I want to show you guys how I look at this. Um, mostly really important for me when it comes to tax time or maybe planning some uh, upcoming rigs. Uh, but this is information that I look at monthly and then definitely end of year when I'm filing taxes here in the U.S. Uh, just really important information to have when I'm reporting all my earnings in crypto. All right, guys, please take care of yourself. Please take care of each other. And I'll see you in the next video.